สวัสดีค่ะ Good afternoon from Thailand and I am now in c h o k Chai Camp. And this is Tony, the guy from c h o k Chai. He work at c h o k c h o k Chai Camp for more than 20 years. And today I come here that to come and show you about the the life of elephant here. After uh, Uncle Eddie, Uncle Eddie is here. Uh, he decided that he will go to take all the s e t t l e off. We are uh, every day now. They are work hard, try to go and take elephant to adjust with the environment. It's not easy to take elephant out of the s e t t l e or the chain, or don't use any hook and let them roam free. They have to practice. And this is to take time. And today, that is, uh, I will come and show you again an update to you. That is, uh, we have we have almost every day the elephant take out. But uh, Guy Tony will tell you later what is they do. They uh, they are uh, work hard with that. So I just want to come and update to you to show you that is even Mahmud sometimes have to stay with elephant to protect that for the conflict. Sometimes they never get freedom, and then we. Take the chain out. They might fighting, so we have to stay very close to them and make sure that is they are okay. Make sure that uh, uh, the the attitude between elephant uh, they will be uh, stay together okay. And and this is for the first step. So to, today is uh, at Chok Chai Camp is zero of the customer, and they have a long time with no no client since February. And it's turned like a sweet off from the money come every day, and they can have a money to uh, look after the elephant. But today, they have zero income. Uh, we have support from Trunk Up, from Greater Good, from Gentle Giant that is can help and and some for Thai people to come and support. We share our fund to s h o k Chai, even not enough. And the guy still jobless because it's no job at all. And he said, since February, right? Yes, sir. This is just only first day he come here because uh, we ask him to come and help Chok Chai. Uh, we have to come and work together. Even he doesn't have income or he didn't have anything at all, but he's he decided to come back to help his boss. So now I would like uh, for all of you also please support Chok Chai and support to Guy Tony and his friend to have the job. And from now, you know, I come here just introduce Tony and un uh, Uncle Eddie. But now he will go and start to take you to show and make you understand that is the elephant is not easy to take them out. But we will make sure that 55 elephant will be roam free. But it will take time. So please support and uh, do anything. Uh, we have also adoption program, which is we will we will talk later to you. Uh, you can support the trunk up, and Guy Tony will will show you. And now I will take off, and then uh, I want you to. Uh, follow uh, Guy Tony. He will show you. Thank you very much. Okay, and now please follow me. I'm gonna show you to our first elephant. Her name is the Molopo. Now she was <coughs> very friendly, and if you want to come in to help her, you can follow us or join in the Trunks Up program. Every day since they're eating food about 300 pounds per day, and now the second one, that's one. Her name is Mabun. Mabun now she is very friendly. You can try to hug around her trunks like this, or you can touch every place of her body because she very friendly. She has uh, practiced many many times, and you can try to our program. Okay, and uh, we had two elephants over there also. The first one on the left, you see the gray color elephant over there. That's one. Her name is m a e l a m y a i m a e l a m y a i Now she is really beautiful color skin. <laughs> Sorry, it's quite slippery now because it's just raining hard before. This is my first day in uh, five months before I had a job. A 
Like you see now, Melam Yai, she starts to eating because each one elephant per day, they're eating food about 16 hours for enjoying their food. Somehow it has a lot of scratch around here. Hey, hey. Okay, she's very friendly also, Melam Yai, and that's one, with, that's one, her name is Ma Pu Khao. Ma Pu Khao, now she has pregnancy. Now she's pregnant about 18 months. We wait about, uh, around four months next before she will give birth another baby. And we hopefully, some uh, our client, you can help her to enjoy to serving her some food, some fun for her. Also, any elephant I had introduced it to you, you can hug her trunk or touching on her body. But now, uh, we had another elephant still in some place else. They need some help or some supporter also. Because of, we had trying to freeing any elephants around here to get their freedom. Now we're coming to see another elephant upper there. And also we had pumpkins for our elephants. Some elephants we had it, they had very good of their ears. They can sensing or hearing something far about two kilometers. Okay, now we come back to Mabund. Mabund, uh, she was around 30 to 35 years old and Uh, I'm not sure she had some baby yet or already or not. You look down. Yeah, maybe. She didn't. Yeah, uh, and my boon, she didn't have any baby yet. We waiting until she had the first baby next time. And uh, my my lamb died over there. She had mating with another male elephant. Uh, we didn't sure because we need to wait about two months before we can test or check about her pregnancy. We had a big problem about fund about for their food because we not have any client any customer in five months and my boss uh, uncle eddie he need to pay for them every day and every day is need a lot of money that's why if you want to support or help us you can join in trunks up program also because every elephant, every day, they need about 300 pounds per one day for their food. 
mostly elephant they eating they eat some kind of sugar cane or some bamboo or some corn tree and also they eat any vegetable And also this elephant, her name was Lam Yai, Ma Lam Yai. Why she had a gray color skin, you know, because she scratched her body with some concrete wall every day, every time, anytime she had the free time, because she loved to make her color or body like this. This one, the pregnancy one, Ma Phu Khao. 18 months pregnant. When some elephant she got pregnant, she need more food like 400 to 500 pounds per day. And some elephant they can live long like humans, about 40 to 60 years old. Okay, if you want to help us to survive in this period, in this period, because we had emergency of the quarantine time, we can have any tourist or customer or client in the in here. You can help us pass this transport program because every elephant we need some funds for help about their food to hire some elephant mahout to bring them to walking like this every day and also if you help us we can have a life again just like me thank you so much ขอบคุณครับผม